Welcome to Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. Today, first look at new speeds. Stay tuned. All right, coffee sponsor of today is new member, new coffee club member, Julian Nguyen. Julian writes, big fan of the channel since discovering it a few months ago. Keep up the great work. Oh, thank you, Julian. <laughs> I appreciate you. Uh, thank you for the uh, subscription to the coffee club. And thank you for today's brew. All right. If you want to be part of my coffee club or want to hook me up with some coffee, network is buymeacoffee.com forward slash tennis spin. If you want to just hook up the channel, super thanks is the way. Link is below. Thank you guys so, so much. Cheers to you. I'm going to actually take another slug. All right. So today, first look at the new speed line. First thing I noticed about each of these speeds is that's not Djokovic on there. But who is that on there? It's Sinner. What's going on? Sinner's on the placard here. That's the first thing I noticed. I was like, where's Djokovic? I'm wondering if Djokovic is going to be the face of his own color scheme. That's just what I'm wondering because he's still on that black one that he's been playing with since the U.S. Open. And my guess is he will be the face of that black one. And they're going to keep this white and black. I don't know. I'm just speculating. But since these are all sinner. Hmm. Hey, Coach Rob. How are you? I'm good. How you doing, Harry? Eh, you know, I had a pretty tough week. A lot of rackets. Oh, man. I don't even know what day it is. A lot of dumb questions. Oh, you wouldn't believe it. But I'm so glad to have you out here today with me. Yeah, looking forward to hitting. Yeah, you wouldn't believe how hard it is for me to find a game. Wow, that's surprising. Well, that's why I have you, Coach. <laughs> so if you're having problems looking for a game, looking for a coach, looking for somebody to play with, try out playyourcourt.com. They'll have tennis buddies for you, matches buddies for you that match well with you. If you need your very own coach, Rob, they'll have that person for you too. And it's playyourcourt.com forward slash tennis spin for half off link is below let's get going coach Rob. let's do it all right so what's new in the speeds well it's auxetic two now two as you can see right there on the inside of that throat auxetic 2.0 auxetic one only had it here in what is called the yoke auxetic two has it added in the handle and the butt now hmm. or feeling the butt okay so Auxetic is supposed to give you more feel, more energy transfer, and a little bit of vibration dampening. So more feel is what came to mind for me. Like that kind of said, okay, well, I like more feel. Dampening usually means they quiet it down. Energy transfer means that it's going to be a little more predictable when the ball leaves the strings. So I'm hoping that it's less dampening and more feel for me at least. And that is enhanced. 
Um, if they did what they did to this racket as the prestigious, there probably shouldn't be a problem there. Okay? Um, I haven't hit them yet. Literally just got them. So that's why I'm showing you. So we first, let me go with the first one. We first got the team. So this is the one with the biggest, well, a pretty good change. This is a new mold. It's a 105 square inch head. You can't tell it's a bigger head, but it is a 105. Now before strings is 270 grams. So fairly light, which is 9.5 ounces. Balance is 325 millimeters, 16 by 19 string pattern on a 24 millimeter beam. So constant 24, 105 on the team. So this would be great for somebody who wants a slightly bigger head, slightly lighter racket. Now the next one in the line, MP light. So MP mid plus light version. 100 square inch head, 280 grams before strings, which is 9.9 .9 ounces. 325 against on that, again on that balance. So 325 millimeters, 16 by 19 pattern. This one is thinned out a bit. 23 constant beam millimeters all the way around. Okay. The top selling racket in the line, the MP, nothing much has changed or nothing has changed except for Auxetic 2.0 and a slight, hmm, this is a matte finish actually, we'll, we'll talk about that in a minute here. Um, 300 grams, which is 10.6, 320 on that balance, 1619 on the string pattern, again 23 millimeters on that beam. So the pro, the pro, the pro, 100, 100 square inches, 310 on the weight, which is 10.9. Now this is where it's changed a bit. It's now a 310 balance, 310. All right, whereas it used to be 315. So, gonna get a little more quickness in that head, maybe. Um, 1820 string pattern on that Pro, 23 millimeters thick, constant beam. Now, the more, like, like I've only gotten a chance to kind of touch it right now, it's got kind of a, well, it does have a matte finish. Um, all of it is a matte finish. Even the black part um, is matte because sometimes they'll go gloss and then matte. This is a matte finish all the way, all the way around. It has that kind of, I don't want to say rubber, rubberness, <laughs> rubbery kind of a texture to it. Um, so it's a little on the duller side, as you can see. It's backwards, but um, check out the lettering there. And it says right there, the power level in their scale. So the Pro is a 300, the MP is a 500. The MPL is a 600, and that team is probably a, oh, I thought it was seven, it's an 800. So in their scale, those numbers, the higher the number, the stiffer the racket, the more power it generates. So hmm, let's get these strung up and uh, test them out. All right, guys, thank you for joining me in the first look of the 2024 Speedline Auxetic 2.0s. Those are the numbers. All right. As you can see, the balance, same in those two. 
little head lighter there, head lighter there. 23 millimeters on uh, the beam, except for the team and uh, the weights. Okay? Guys, thank you for watching Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis.